For so many teenagers, the summer provides that coveted downtime. But for Chris Glazer, his downtime is being spent looking up. 18, teaching adults is kind of, it's funny. Earlier this month, Chris graduated from Middletown High. But he's been part of higher education for months. This is our drone ground school, our part 107 ground school. Kids instructing first responders. The students are the teachers. It's part of Middletown High's drone and flight science class. Traverse left for down San Juan to line with 1D. Paul Pelletier runs the aerospace program here. So the kids grew up with video games, and so the kids just have a natural uh, ability to fly the drones, and so they're the, the best ones to, to impart it to the, to the first responders. Basically, how to fly, and we get them to fly around all three buckets, taking photos, doing what we call orbits, which is like little diagonal movement, keeping the camera centered, and different stuff like that. So it's a really good practical use, especially for our first responders. Delilah Van Ness is a rising sophomore grounded by the data. She administers all the quizzes. I do the classroom part, so I'm more of the information side. And then we grade them so they know how they're doing and what they need to work on. It's a two week long course, 80 hours worth of training, and this time around, there are a dozen students involved. The Middletown Fire Department already has a dedicated drone team that keeps adding pilots. It's a humbling experience because the kids, they're 10 times better than I am flying this. So it's been a learning curve for me. And the idea out here is to actually go next level. It's win-win. When you can get the kids and the first responders and everybody's learning, um, that's, I think that's what education is supposed to be all about. In Middletown, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.